What's going on, people? Troops TV, back again. Back our blood clot again, you understand? Match reaction time, you get me. Um, as you can tell, Arsenal lost, you get me. Aston Villa won, Arsenal nil. Now, Man City went there uh, during midweek and failed the Villa Park test. And now we have failed the Villa Park test test um where do you start bro you understand absolutely piss poor performance bro you get me um let's have it right only one player can walk off that pitch with their head held high only one player performed for 98 minutes and that's kai havertz blood you get me he was the only player that was trying to make things happen that was causing a problem, that was getting stuck in, that that was actually showing the desire and intensity you need in, in this type of game, blood. You get me? Martin Odegaard, piss poor again, bro, to say the least, blood. You get me? He's had the best two chances of the game, full to him, middle of the box, all alone on your left foot. The first one, you hit straight at Martinez. The second one, don't even hit the target, blood. Do you understand? Like, I'm a big fan of Odegaard. I'm a big defender of Odegaard because he gets a lot of criticism away from home. Rightly so as well, blood. You get me? Because today, he was Martin Ozil, blood. You get me? Anonymous, hiding. He didn't... There was no leadership. There was no signs of a captain. He did not perform well on the pitch. He did not lead by his performance. Like, okay, cool. You're not going to talk. Lead by example. Play well. Show fight. Show desire. He was absolutely piss poor, blood. He was none of the above. You get me? Um, David Rea, the first chance he has, he drops the ball, blood. You get me? But um, he did look shaky as well, blood. You get me? But he did manage to um, get through the game without causing any errors that led to a goal. Speaking about the goal, blood, you get me? <clears throat> the politician, a.k.a. <clears throat> excuse me. Speaking about the goal as well, blood, you get me? The politician, a.k.a. Zinchenko, Yet again, at fault for the goal, blood. You get me? But he wasn't the only one at fault, blood. Benny Blanco was just as much at fault as Zinchenko was. You get me? I have no issue with Zinchenko going to um, Leon Bailey and um, pressing him when he has the ball. My problem is when Bailey pops it off and then makes the run, you're there following the ball, blood. Why are you ball chasing? Why are you not following the man? You didn't allow Bailey to get in behind you. Pause. Gabriel, don't get tight enough. Let's him cross in the ball. And then Benny Blanco's in there, standing in there like a fucking garden gnome. Literally, all he had to do was look to the right. You'll see him again. You block the cross, blood. You could block the shot. You could block the cross. You could, you could make an effect on the game. You could stop that chance from happening, bro. You get me? But you're just static. You're flat-footed. You're not scanning. You're not looking around. It was piss poor, bro. You get me? Like, these men should have known what this game was going to be. We're the last team to beat them at Villa Park, bro. 14 games they had won until today. Now it's 15 in a row at Villa Park, blood. And they're not beating no dickhead teams. They're beating proper teams, blood. They're beating us and Man City back-to-back -back like Drake, blood. You get me? And now, you understand, I've said it many occasions, if we don't go out in the transfer window and press the button, we ain't winning no major trophies, bro. You get me? Because now we're going to Anfield, Behind Liverpool, blood. And that's what you don't want, bro. You don't want to go to Anfield with your confidence a bit low because them man there, if, 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 if the wound is open, they're pouring bare salt in there, blood. Hella salt, blood. You understand? So, you get me? I'm not looking forward to that trip, blood. You lot let me know your thoughts on the game in the comments below. Let me know if you agree with me. Let me know if you don't. The last thing I'm going to end it with is we're chasing the goal and you bring on Eddie and Ketty, your blood. If a striker isn't needed after seeing that blood, after seeing our bench, then I don't know when we're going to sign a striker blood. You feel me? But yeah, man, you lot know the vibe. Like, share, comment and subscribe. It's your boy Troops. And I'm out, blood.